What's up everyone, Reed here for Animal Wire, and if cryptic animals are your thing, then just consider the fangs you're about to see icing on the cake. As this perplexing wonder was posted to Anwar Paktem's Facebook page with a coded message in Malay that seems to translate to something like he's never caught anything of the sort before and wants to know what he's dealing with. Well, it's safe to say the creature before you belongs to the Gobi family, which is a very broad category containing a couple thousand different species of fish spread throughout six distinct subgroups. One of which is the mudskippers, whom you might already know from all the prancing around they do outside the water. But our captivating little critter falls within a different division referred to as the eel gobies. And I know they kind of give off that vibe like maybe they've pledged their allegiance to a Sith Lord. But rest assured, there's nothing malicious about them. They're just rocking that look, cause well, it suits them for where they live. Typically down in muddy burrows around shallow inner tidal zones. And check it out, if you were always skedaddling around these typed cramped spaces, you'd want a nice svelte and tapered body too. But as for eyes, get out of here with that nonsense. They're energy intensive, way overrated in murky water. So instead, let me sell you on some dank cutaneous ridges all over your head and body that when loaded up with sensitive nerve endings makes navigating this type of environment a cakewalk. And for its teeth, yeah, those are pretty gnarly. Enlarged and fang-like, they remind me of other sea creatures who employ a snag and swallow strategy. So perhaps something like a small octopus or maybe a crab is getting caught up in there. As I wouldn't think this guy can be much more than a foot long and maybe as small as a few inches. And if in some alternate reality you happen to find yourself stepping on one, you're losing a toe or two at worst. Maybe, maybe not. Anyway, big thanks to Slice Team for sending this fish on over our way. And once again, thanks for tuning in and giddy up.